you guys doing? I'm Joe Mania, and we're going to be showing you Community Day, Charmander Community Day. Let's get those shinies, guys. Bring them on. All right, let's find those shinies, guys. Oh, no shiny yet. Oh, no, I accidentally killed Weedle. No shiny, though. Oh, no. Come on. Give me a shiny. No. Come on. Bring me the luck. Oh, shiny Charmander. Beast mode, beast. Let's catch it. Boom. One, two, and three. We catch our shiny Charmander. The very first Charmander. Into the decks. All right. Let's get those shinies. No. 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 No luck for me. No. All right. Let's get on to the tasks. Hey there, Joe Mania. I hope you and your fellow trainers have been taking care of yourselves. Remember to take a break every now and then. Do something you really enjoy. I like to go on a short walks myself. In fact, I was out for a stroll with a buddy Pokemon earlier when I heard a strange crackling sound. Upon further inspection, I realized it was a large group of Charmin gathered in an open field. The sources of noise was the soft crackling of the tail flames. Seeing so many Charmin at once, highly unusual though. It was, wasn't the first time I've witnessed such a gathering. Well, whatever the reason, this is the perfect chance to learn more about Charmin. Would you mind giving me a hand of catching some? I will. Power up 10 Pokemon. Catch 15 Charmanders. Make 5 nice throws. Let's go, guys. We can do this. Uh, no. No. We didn't get that shiny. Must. Wonderful work, trainer. While you were out in the field, I looked through some research focused on Charmin and the evolution line and came away with the interesting information. For starters, Charmin is also known as the lizard Pokemon and seems to be fond over hot things. You can tell how Charmin is feeling by looking at the flames burning at the tips of its tail. What a fascinating Pokemon. Hmm. Perhaps these Charmin I ran into while walking were gathering to enjoy the sun. We may be able to learn more about evolving one. Hmm. Charmander evolving form is Charmeleon, but be, be, be careful when evolving Charmander. Charmeleon is known for its techniques. Alright. Catch 15 Charmander. Transfer 10 Pokemon. Evolve 3. Shiny Charmander! Yes! And CP is 728. Sounds awesome! Alright, let's get that shiny. Hopefully we get some good IVs. Two and three! Three with the Master Ball. And 12 catches of Charmander so far. Now let's see. Let's get another shiny. You ah no ah no ah no yes no bingo no. All right, let's claim our rewards. Twenty candies. Thousand Stardust. And the claim reward? Charmeleon! Yeah! It's Golden Raspberry, this. Alright, Charmeleon. We have you now. The fire of flames within Charmeleon. And gotcha! 900 Stardust. And let's see if it's good. Oh, not the greatest. Let's claim a reward. 2,000 Stardust. 
incense and a puffin. Yeah! That's fine, Charmeleon. You got with you Jomania. Known as the flame Pokemon. Charmeleon is high headed by nature and consistently seeking out oh, worthy opponents for battles. When it's finally encountered as a worthy foe, it becomes exciting that the flame type of its tail flares up and turns br blush white color. The easiest way to cl calm a Charmeleon down is by winning a battle. That sure sounds like a certain team leader I know. That's me! Now, did you know Charmeleon can evolve? Not only that, but evolve from Char Charizard is also known as the Flame Pokemon. Come back and see once you evolve, once you evolve your Charmeleon. All right, make three great curveball throws. Evolve one Charmeleon. Transfer ten Pokemon. Let's go! All right, well, let's claim our reward. They finish. Twenty candies, five raspberries, and let's see. Let's claim our reward. 2,000 Stardust, one incense, a rocket radar! Congrats, trainer. Your Charmeleon has now become the flame Pokemon Charizard. Charizard is truly an amazing Pokemon. Its wings can carry its clothes to altitude, altitude of 4,600 feet, and its fierce breath packs such a great heat that it can melt almost anything. While all the raw power seems intimidating, Charizard never turns its flames on any opponent weaker than itself. What a superb display of control. It's amazing to see how this Pokemon chooses to take on only the mightiest opponents. They say the key to success partnership is a powerful bond trainer, so why not celebrate by spending a little time with your char new Charizard? Alright, make 15 nice throws, catch 15 Charmeleons, power up. Pokemon 10 times! Alright, let's claim our reward. 5 silver pineapple berries, 1500 XP, 5000 claim rewards, and let's claim our reward, our main reward. 2000 Stardust, 3 rare candies, yes! And a mysterious Pokemon. Who's that Pokemon? Charizard! Let's see, 1200 CP. With a golden raspberry, let's see. Ah, oh, Charizard being a pain. Oh, my shiny Gibble comes back and counters. Bam! That's where it's at. Gotcha. Thirteen hundred Stardust. Let's see. Let's see if it's good. Oh, two Stardust. Two stars. That's sad. Well, let's see. I can see you're really putting an effort in strengthening the bond between you and your Pokemon, Jomaine. Did you know that the bond become source of power for certain Pokemon? That's right. I'm talking about Mega Evolution. I can see you're really putting in the effort. Okay, Mega Evolution is the result of strong connection between a Pokemon and its trainer. Charizard is unique not only because it's Mega Evolved, but it's also because it has two different Mega Evolved forms. It's two Mega Evol Evolution, Mega Charizard X and Mega Charizard Y each come with their own strengths. Alright, I got it. It said that the overwhelming power dwelling within Mega Charger X is intense that it turns into its body black and causes blue flames to spill out of its mouth. It sounds intense. Other research suggests that Mega Charger Y uses its bond as trainer as a source of its power using speed greater than that of a fighter's jet. Ooh. Something amazing. I can't wait to see how trainers use this Mega Evolution. Evolutions in their gym battle strategies. Thanks again for your help, Jomania. I'll be in touch as soon as I have more exciting research to share. I'm hoping everyone got to enjoy their Charmander Community Day. Hopefully, you guys tell me how many shinies did you guys get during the Community Day, and hopefully, you guys get a good one. Maybe Shundo. <laughs> and also, make sure you get to beat Team Rocket, Team uh, Team Grunts too. So that way you get the new 12 kilometer egg. When you beat Team Rocket, you get a 12 kilometer egg. Not guaranteed, but I wish you guys good luck.